Tomb Raider. Tomb Raider. What did it get? Uh, 6.6 on IMDb. Yeah, no, it actually got more than... 49% on Rotten Tomato, though. Got more than... Um, 4.4 4. 4 out of 5 on Facebook. Yeah, no, what is Facebook now? What is Facebook? <laughs> Hey guys, welcome to that unnamed movie chat show. We're here to uh, give you a review on Tomb Raider. Prepare for some spoilers! Spoilers. Spoilers! Big as big as spoilers. the blood holes in the movie! Yeah, I was looking forward to this so, so much. So, so much. Because, like, come on, it's Tomb Raider. I, 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 to be honest, I think um, a lot of people were. I think... You have to let her have a no, chance. No, I just want to say, I mean, you're, yeah. you're saying that we you were, were looking useless. forward to it, and I think that a lot of people were looking forward mm. to Tomb Raider. The trailers look good, the write-ups trailers look good. Trailers look amazing. The idea of rebooting the Lara Croft character was a good idea. Yeah. Brilliant char like actress to put in that role, but um, for a female-driven film uh, protagonist that's supposed to be like epic and powerful and... For me, I felt like Laura Croft was a weak little panda. <laughs> she portrays herself as some like hooligan um, against. Being a little rough, eh? Uh, yeah, I also think she'd be a little harsh. No, I mean, she's a messenger. Bike messenger. She's a bike messenger. But she's an MMA sport. And sure. she did she's archery good. growing up. Yeah, yeah, but the point Big is that deal. in in hold up, hold up. In the fight scenes where where she was in a fight scene, she handled herself. Yeah. She was, however, prone to going eh, oh, oh, when she fell down, <laughs> which is fine. It's the first time she's actually been in a fight for her life. It's not, you know, no, we know she makes good points. You know okay, I mean? time's up. You're finished. Yeah, yeah okay, it's, okay. Not, it's not like yeah, they're true. in the MMA ring where you can be like, oh, okay, you can tap out now. Yeah, you're not going to be killed. You know what I mean? Yeah. I can't get you. I think it's fair to say that on her first outing, she was going to be a little bit tentative and whatever. I'm guessing if. God forbid they do a sequel, they they will make her tougher. If um, they do a sequel, could they actually write a plot that somebody gives a shit about? See, this is this is the issue. The issue is not about the Laura. actress Laura, of Laura. Laura was fine. I think Laura was fine. I think the story that Laura was in was, was utter it? shite. Horrible. It it was almost like they'd taken a textbook and said, okay, these are the points I need to hit in order to get this kind of story done. So I'm just going to make up random crap that all happened seven years ago. Seven years. I've been on this island. And put it in here. And everything is seven years ago. Seven, Seriously, seven, did that seven, happen seven, seven years ago? Seven years ago. Really? Really? Seven? Oh, oh my God. God. Seven years ago for me too. I know. And for you, how about you? Did you have oh, something seven, seven years, years ago? ago? Yeah. Wow. Every, seven years? Everything was seven, seven years, years ago. ago. My word, wow. what a coincidence. Also, bum, bum, bum. do we not have the stupidest mercenaries on the face of the planet? <laughs> They've been on the island for seven years, but nobody thought to look in the freaking cave by the sea to We're make dead. sure the guy was dead. Yes. Also, when the bad guy says, I killed him, how did he kill him? Yeah. Did you know he's dead? Did, did you, you see a body? Did you see a body? This, is this, hold on. This is the this is a number one rule. Didn't kill him. Him this is survived. the number one rule in all movies. Anything on the planet. If you don't see the dead body, presume he's alive. Lara comes Drown back, him. and then we have this moment of Daddy being all like, "Oh no, she'll go away. She'll go she'll away. She's not gone, ready here. She's gone, gone crazy yeah. for all these seven years that I've been here by myself. I'm going away." Lara says, "But Daddy, it's me." And suddenly he's cured. Look, it's whatever. Me. Look, Daddy, it's me. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yeah, and he's back. Not to only is he cured, he has a full med kit. Yeah, no one knew that. That he hasn't had to use for seven years, so dysentery it. obviously hasn't been a problem for him. Yeah. You know, <laughs> hasn't accidentally cut his arm or chopped his leg. You're living those things, amongst like, living the mercenaries the and not Liv being You know, caught. running for his life from the mercenaries for seven years. <laughs> med kit is still full. Another, another point just That's to make on this cool. is that uh, the bad guy... Was, was so one-dimensional, it was ridiculous. The only yeah. reason that he was the bad guy was because, oh look, I shot that guy who was thick and weakly and to carry the thing in the job you must stop her evil. No, it wasn't that scary. And I just thought, I mean, why so didn't what? you like, you know when she infiltrates the... No, oh, wait, wait. Sorry. You know when she... Wow, that was, that was pretty cool. How old? Just You know it. when she infiltrates the camp after, like, she's like, no, dad. Like, I was going, she goes yeah. and she got a bow and arrow and she snuck in. Suddenly she... She could literally just kill him. Why didn't you just put the... Arrow through him. Like, yeah. I'm like, why are you hiding? She My, said, no. Okay, okay. Like, and then another thing, right? Another thing, another one of these giant blood holes is. I think it was, was Swiss cheese. I mean, seriously, no, it was. It was, yeah. Swiss, cheese. It was Swiss, Swiss cheese. Swiss cheese. The I script love was cheese, Swiss but not this. It was terrible. You know, it, was, it was just cheese with big holes in it. And one of the other big holes is. So she was on a boat. 
I'm with a Japanese fun. guy who speaks really good American. Yo, yes. Oh my gosh. Exceptional American. <laughs> and and no explanation as to how he speaks really good American. Yeah. But he. Um, but on top of that, he then gets captured when she gets captured. And through the course of the fact that this woman came into his life. Very suddenly. Very suddenly. T took him to a faraway know. island where he's now the prisoner of some people who I killed his father and her. want to kill him. Death is not an adventure. He's not leaving without her. Yeah. Because yes. that's the kind of loyalty he's got. That's insane. Yes, that's just insane. insane. You don't get the kind nice. of loyalty no, like... No. And even in a movie, I'm sorry, you cannot sell that to me. I no, agree with you. You can't I sell don't that. Buy it I'd be like, and then all of them, all the little Asian people are like, "Hey, we must wait for Laura." <laughs> we <laughs> feel like we're going to get to the. We the agree. <laughs> they're, they're all. On they're out. They've gone. They've run away. The bad guys are all in the cave. No, These no, no. guys have got to the beach. They're ready to go. But one guy says, "We must go back for Laura," no, no. and they're all like, "Yes, yes we must go back for Laura." Wait, wait, no, no, should we? I don't even know if this is a spoiler because they gave it away themselves. But when you introduce only one other only character, one other character <laughs> who has any kind of bearing on your supposed plot right in the beginning of the movie, oh, right, your father's gone. Oh, Emma, um, then you don't see her again until right at the end. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You Kristen. know she's the bad guy. Yeah, Kristen Scott Thomas. <laughs> yeah, Kristen yeah. Scott Thomas. I love her. She's but she, you but knew she was the bad guy. You utilized her. You knew she was the bad guy from the minute you met her because all of yeah. a sudden, here's this character. Why do we need to know about this character? Oh, no, because she's important and she's loving oh, Laura but and she's No, blah, 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 blah. but you but, didn't even buy into that love. I no. saw her come on and I'm like, oh, bad you're guy. evil. I'm like, you want her to sign over stuff? Bad, mm, guy. Yeah. bad yeah. guy. And the way she looked oh, at her was like, bad bad guy. Guy. but I feel like there's a better story she there. She is bad guy. Much better. There's a, if you Zangit just, says she is bad guy. Zangi. Okay, I feel like that would have been the better story. <laughs> like, I'm more intrigued what would happen there. And if you do a sequel, go that way, but don't give us plot holes. Like, I'm all for giving you another shot. I really am. I, I could give it yeah. another shot. I love the Tomb Raider franchise, okay? I still think Angelina and Jolie's first was film good. was my favorite. No, I mean, the okay, I'm not going to agree like... with that. I, mean, the, uh, I think all the Tomb Raider movies so far have been total crap. Okay, when I grew up with like that, that was pretty young. Thanks so much for watching, everybody. We've come to the end of ripping Tomb Raider apart. Yeah, um, sorry. We didn't please like don't it. give us too much hate. If you like or don't like or agree or disagree with us, please let us know in the comments below. We will check them out and uh, take them into account, maybe, for next time. Um, also, if you've got any ideas of movies you want us to have a look at, old movies, new movies, we're open to everything. Superhero man. movies. Whatever. Let us know. Also, what clothing? Once again, thanks for our cool shirts. Yes. I really do like them. I really feel uh, like We I think they look cool and, and people should go buy them. Oh my head. Now yeah. that you just made the biggest noise in the world. <laughs> so thanks so much for watching. We'll catch you again next time. Bye. Peace. Bye. Peace.